Hey everyone, welcome back to another video. So today's video is gonna be a little different. I am announcing the giveaway winner and I'm also doing an LV binder review for everyone who is interested in maybe purchasing this binder. Thank you guys all so much for entering into my 10K giveaway. It was extremely hard choosing a winner for this, but I do plan on doing more giveaways similar to this in the near future. So if you guys are interested in giveaways like this, then continue watch and I will be announcing more future giveaways. And without taking too long, the winner for this giveaway is My Crazy Kiddos. Thank you so much for supporting me and my channel. And thank you honestly everyone for entering into this giveaway. It was really, really hard choosing a winner. And I think next time I might do a few winners. I do want to thank everyone so much for entering in the giveaway and I hope you guys all achieve your goals soon soon. Um, I love this budgeting community because it helped me achieve a lot of my goals and that's honestly why I want to give back and show you guys what I did to get myself out of honestly a lot of debt. But without further ado, let's get into the binder review. Okay, so before I do the giveaway, I know my finger is going to be showing a lot and my nail did break, so ignore my thumb there. So when you receive the binder, um, it is going to come in a box like this. So when you open this up, okay, so when you open up the binder, I am going to be including this pouch in there as well. For my last binder that I sewed, um, they didn't come with these, but I'm just going to leave these in here in case you guys are interested. But when you open this up, let me just move this out of the way. Okay, so when you open up the binder here, it does come with a little um, information stuff. I don't know, but I'm just going to include that in there for you guys. And this is the binder. Okay, so this binder is really, really cute. Okay, so this is how the binder is going to be coming in. This is a brand new one that I'm showing you guys so you guys can see exactly how you will be receiving the binder. So it's super cute. It has a little button here. I don't want to peel this, but um, it's a really cute Louis Vuitton uh, button here. And this is the exact binder you will be receiving. And I don't know the measurements right now, but I will enter in the measurements on the screen here if you guys are interested. If you guys want to relate it to something you might have, this is an A6 and I only saw them in A6. I did recently get like a free sample of an A7. So if you guys are interested in seeing how the A7 looks like, then continue. And I'll show you guys at the end. But the A7 one, I'm telling you guys, I am in love with it. And it is really huge compared to this. Let me grab it really quick so I can just show you guys really quickly. It is the box it came in. And the company, they basically gave this to me to, I don't know why, but I was just like, okay, let's do it. But this is the A7 and it is huge. I am so excited to turn this into my binder or not my binder, my planner. So that's going to be really exciting. But these are the size difference, you guys. It's huge. So I think this is so cute for my sinking funds and all that stuff. But this for my planner is going to be so freaking cute. Actually, I'm not going to show you guys. So if you guys are interested, I will show you at the end of the video. Here, so when you open the binder up, so the binder is going to look like this. It does have the 2022 and 2025 inserts in here. Okay, so when you open this up right away, as I mentioned, there's about six card holders here that you can use. You can put placeholders, whatever you like into these. I've seen so many different ways people do um, design their planner. It's pretty much up to you. Mine is pretty simple because I just use it for like my sinking funds and all that stuff. So I do have placeholders that I put in here. And each binder will also come with this little Louis Vuitton card here. Um, nothing too special on that. But it also has a little back pocket here, which I am in love with because my binder itself does not have that. So that is super cute. So it has the back pouch here. And when you look into these, these has super cute inserts. It has an address book, which I don't use, but these really cute paper. What I did with mine was I laminated these papers so I can just reuse them. So 
girl that is a smart hack for anyone who buys one of these planners you can reuse this instead of buying new inserts just laminate them cut them hole punch them and slap them back in your binder then let's move into the back so this is like a very light gold um ring here so it almost looks silver honestly but it's actually like a tint of gold but it's really cute and then in the back here it has like all the other ones um a little pouch here so you can put paper placeholders whatever you like back here and it also has a little pen holder here but this is the binder review so if you guys are interested in this binder then definitely dm me on instagram or on etsy it is going to be a little bit more expensive if you purchase it through etsy due to fees that etsy charge themselves so i do have to up the price on that um i'm trying to think of anything else that i need to let you guys know that people have questions on a lot of you have questions on is if this is the real binder and no it is not i did mention it multiple times to a lot of you that messaged me privately about the binders if they are real and they are not this is a replica honestly it's really close looking to it i'm trying to pull up a picture so you guys can see Okay, so this is a picture of, of the real one, and it doesn't show too, too much. I don't know why it's not swiping, but it doesn't show too much of it. But if you can see, it looks pretty identical. And then it is $675, so no way do I sell this on my real shop. Mine are going for $100. These are $675. So if you want to buy the real one, go ahead. They still have them available on their websites, but... If you want something pretty similar to that binder itself, then message me. But I think that's pretty much it. If you guys do have any questions, comment them down below and I can see if I can answer all of your questions. Okay, so this is the binder that they sent me. I don't know if they just sent it for me to review or what, but I don't care. I'm in love with it. It's so cute and it's huge. It's about the size of my planner. I have a happy planner that I use basically every single day and it is about this size and it's given so if you open this binder up i didn't even want to take this out because i wanted to review it with you guys first so if you open this up it looks pretty similar on the inside there are a little bit like different features on the binder pull this a little bit over here so you guys can see so it does have a little pouches here and back here it has about two of them which the other one doesn't has more of like card slots but this one has it for like papers and i don't know whatever you guys want to add into this you guys can do that and it does have the inserts which are huge so these are really big inserts i'm not sure if i'm going to use all of them but i do want to laminate some of these and keep them in here because this is really cute um for the address book i am not sure i probably won't use that but we'll see and then the back part has another pocket here which is similar to this one but it's just a little bigger and then it has the back piece where you can put notepads and paper anything you guys pretty much want back here it also has a little pin pouch here but i don't sell this binder yet i'm just basically reviewing it for myself and yeah if you guys are interested in maybe purchasing this let me know and if i get enough people inquiring about purchasing this then we can work something out but these are a lot more expensive than the small one as you guys can see the size difference is huge and i believe these are goes for around 900 and something on the website so almost a thousand dollars i think let me see okay so i pulled it up it's going for 920 so that's pretty expensive. I personally would not spend that much on a planner. It probably won't be $100 like these binders, but maybe closer to the $200. I don't see it going for anything more than that. So that is all for today's video. Thank you so much for entering into the giveaway. We will be doing another giveaway similar to this in the near future. If you guys are interested in purchasing this like I mentioned, then just message me on Instagram or Etsy. Thank you guys all so much for watching and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye.